Good, good evening again, everyone. Welcome back here to the PIC program Week of Prayer. And now today we are with a different speaker, the one of the PM session. Welcome all of you. And we have a different student as well because we want to interview them. We want to know their experiences. We want to know their point of view. And we have the same classmates this morning. Yeah, welcome all of you. They will interview them and they will give information about them. Good evening, Brother Aryan. Thank you for lending us your time this evening to answer a few questions regarding our week of prayer with the theme, Origins. My first question for you is, what is your reaction about today's topic? I am blessed uh, and happy because balance leads me to labor with the Lord, develop all of my characters, and to know the value of all aspects of my life that God given to me. Good evening, Sister Honey, and thank you for allowing us to interview you this evening. For my first question, please tell me about your preparations for this year's week of prayer, and have you experienced any challenges throughout your preparation? Yeah, so thank you for that question. So this year's um, week of prayer is, has been a blessing to me. So I just knew that I will be the one speaking just like I, three weeks ago. And I prepared uh, by, you know, you need to prepare your heart and your mind. So, uh, devotional in the evening and the, uh, the morning. So, have that um, uh, personal devotion with him. I did that during evening and the morning. And I've experienced challenges. Because uh, I'm not... I have many challenges that I cannot say to you now because it's so long, so too many. So I'll just say one thing. I did procrastinate once, but the Lord um, did something and He made that procrastination into a blessing. But because God does that, right? If we distort our paths, He will make it straight for us. So... I have many challenges, but the Lord helped me through it. And I realized that it is not about me. It's about how He works through me and how we will, He will use me as His tool of blessing to others. Amen. It is truly by surrendering ourselves to God that He can fully use us through His ministry. Amen. So for the next question for you, Brother Aryan, is as a student, what values can you learn from the week of prayer? As a student, the values that I have learned from this week of prayer are in the following. The first one is, looking always to Christ and believing in Him are the more effective ways to understand our great origin. His words assess us in determining who provides the origin of all because he is the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. The second one is, Jesus gave us the, our identity. Being His sons and daughter, identities, receiving His love, the gift of faith, and the honor of being part of those people who are waiting to His second soon return. The third one is, God, God's masterpiece is a human being. Life, strength, and knowledge are bestowed. He is aware of our abilities and everything we possess. We can't do anything without Jesus and we don't know what our purpose is. If we don't look the one to the one who made us and knows what's best for us. And the fourth one, rest to God and learn to Him can help us to find the true meaning of balance to all aspects of life. And for my last question for you this evening, Sister Honey, describe the effects of your topic on the students' lives. Okay, so um, I think personally, it's my life has been uh, like transformed. And I learned from this topic of mine how to balance things, uh, on how important balance is in our lives. And balance, it's not just for out out of somewhere but it is in Christ alone that you can find your balance because he offers rest 
and He tells us to labor for Him. And that's how we will balance our Christian lives. So I think that the effect of this on the students' lives is they will know that the balance and they will learn on how to balance their lives, especially in their spiritual and their Christian walk with Jesus Christ. Thank you, Sister Honey, for reminding us to always rest in Christ. For the last but not the least question, why do you think this topic is relevant relevant for you as a student? Me as a student, this topic is relevant because balance can help me to know the importance of working and studying with the Lord. And if I got tired in all aspects of my life as a student, God offers me to have balance to him by resting in him and learning on him every day. Thank you for answering our questions and for spending your time with us. So this is the end of our interview for the second day of our week of prayer for the third and fourth session. <laughs>